Hello, people of the internet. I am Solrak Dragon. Welcome back to Dark Souls 3. At long last, we get you. You don't know how many times. Uh. I died getting to this. That's different. My base has not looked so sunken in before. Um. We get the Firekeeper's armor. Why does my appearance look so weird? Um, while we're in this precarious situation, let's read some item descriptions, I guess. The Pale Tongue, proof of an invader's victory over a host of embers. Proof of a red orb invader's victory over a host of embers. Claiming tro tongues as trophies was generally the practice of an infidus troop of invaders who offer them to their speechless god. Yes. Hmm, I'm not sure on that one. That does make me think of, um, maybe that's why that one dude gave us that little quest. Fire gem. A gem of infused titanite find in rare cases inside of demons. So that was a fire demon or something. Um, this lift chamber key. Key to the room of the lift that descends to the deepest dungeon in Lothric. A surviving dark wraith from the land sold by darkness is said to be held there. Now, the only key that I can think of was, um, back in the high chamber place. So I'll be checking there. I only do have the dark sigil. Is that? Maybe. Wait. Dark sigil will never heal, but there's a tale told of a fire keeper who returned from an abyss and brought great comfort to the bearer of a curse. Interesting. Very interesting. Um. Firekeeper's robe. Robe worn by the guardian of the shrine. Robe of light to better serve as vessels for the soul. Only those who cherish the wreathing, searing darkness were given the firekeeper's black attire. I mean, it's not bad, to be completely honest, but I think we will keep our Mira set for now. And outside of that, nothing. Um, my appearance is disturbing. <sighs> Just dying? Do it to me? I'm not so concerned about the 4,000 souls, but... Wait. He's unlocking our power. Dude. Are you the cause for this? You. Did you cause this to happen to me? Oh, I... You can draw out our true strength again. As I have the lab, but the I only thing we've done them. is dying. He's drawing out the strength of the dark sign. The dark sign is what caused the hollowing. So, is he causing us to become hollow by drawing out the strength? Huh. Then shove it. Draw up my strength again. Another thing of endurance. Yes. Then shall we begin? We can do it Aaron. again. Another. Ah, all will soon be clear, my good lord. Ah, oh. Um. What do you mean by that, dude? As I have the lab, I weep that thou be safe. Our Lord? Okay, that just creeped me out. As is my decrepit appearance, but, um... I did end up going to... Well, as you saw at the end of last episode, I was talking to that dude there, and he gave me an additional Ashen Estus Flask, because I decided that was what would be the best to go for. Um... It was... In... High wall here. The tower on the wall, I want to say, was um, where like there was a staircase downward, the spiral staircase downwards, and there was a locked gate, I want to say. So yeah, we're going to go there next. See if that lift key can get us into there. And then, I don't know, to be completely honest, um, it's odd. Very, very odd. I will have Lothric. Um, we are stronger now, at the very least, so these dudes should be no real trouble. Still take two hits to kill, though. Okay. Um. Managed to hit through the shield, that's fine. Where was that? There was, like, a gate that was blocked. It was further down, wasn't it? Yeah, I think it was further down. 
So we got Axe Dude here. Who? Oh, I was gonna say who we could just, um. Yeah, there's that gate that I was thinking of. There we go. Oh, Titanite Shark. Oh, you guys dropped Titanite Sharks. Cool. Um, is this? It is. Lift chamber key. Okay, so it's because there's a lift. Be wary of tough enemy. Well, if what that dude said is true, there's a dark wraith here. And dark wraiths were a covenant in Dark Souls. It is. It's a fucking dark wraith. Well, this should be interesting, to say the least. Yeah, dark spirit, in fact. Very, very dark spirit. Still has that old shield. Um, let's get into a more open battlefield here because I don't like narrow fields with you. Okay, so a dark wraith, huh? You're just as fast, and you still have that humanity grab. That massive boost to endurance was very well done by me. Well, the Star Grape is down, and he dropped a red eye orb for us. Are you... What are... Are those tongues? Or is that just weeds? Don't know. No, they're just weeds. Okay. Um. The Dark Wraith is dead, so. And we. Oh god, we are more decrepit. Our skin. Whoa. That's very disturbing. Very disturbing indeed. Um. Maybe go and talk to that guy now and see what he says. Because it might be interesting. Um. It's right here. Here. Go to our bonfire and return. Oh, he gave us a lot of souls as well. Alright, rest and let's head back to the Firelink Shrine here. I realize that I'm not actually following through with my promise right this second and making progress in the one area by killing the thing that's shooting, but um, this could be interesting. In fact, we've done a lot of interesting things thus far. You. Aha, you found a proper red eye. That I have. Brilliant. I knew you were no ordinary man. The applause amount. Now invade and pillage all you like. Okay. And if you grow weary of your duty, you too may become a finger. A finger? Come on. Give yourself to Rosaria of the Cathedral of the Deep. <laughs> Now what do you mean? And come on. Rosalia of the Cathedral of the Deep. Give yourself to the finger. So I'm guessing that is another covenant. Potentially. Um. No. We're not going to talk to that one dude right At now. The foot of he, if he's causing me to become decrepit. And I don't like that. Um. Alright. Travel bonfire. We want to go to the cliff underside bonfire here, I think. Is that the closest we can get? I think it is. Alright, so... Cliff... Side... Or the underside cliff bonfire thing. Okay... There we go. And also, I'm wondering, is, human is an ember gonna cure us of our ugliness? Like an ember does, or does ember cure like a humanity does? It does not. Well, um, that's disturbing. So we're gonna be stuck with an ugly mug forever. That sucks. I don't want to be known as ugly face McGee here. Oh. Which way is the right way to go here? Please be an utterly forget. Um, 
can drop down here. Yeah, we can drop down here. Oh wait, we could've gotten here quicker. If we had taken the... Yeah, that's right, that's right. And with less damage too. I completely blanked out on that fact. Okay, drink this flask and you know what? We're just gonna charge on by you suckers. Because we got endurance to spare. Woo! Can't catch me, can't catch me, nana nana boo boo. Oh god, please be here, lift. Okay, the lift is here. You can't catch me, nana nana boo boo. Okay, you're going down, that's right. The lift only goes down. At least that's what he saw. Um, where does this lead me? A lower area. Okay. I completely didn't think to go down here. So let's take a look around here. Um, hmm. Lower portion of the tower. Item sitting in the middle of the floor with a... Something. Whoa! You're like the one boss! Holy shit! Okay! Well, well, well. Looks like we might have a bit of a challenge here. Um, clearly not this bonfire, though. Well, it's either fall damage or not, so... Oh, no, we can avoid the fall damage, yeah. For the most part, at least. Um, it does involve quite a bit of running, though, but that's fine. Here to here. Then we run like the Dickens! Charles Dickens, for those wondering. Um, ignore the fast hang of pain and misery. We are running so much right now. Ow! You friggin' big jerks. Blood loss. I would never have guessed. Um... Well, uh, that happened. We're not going to let it happen again, of course, because we'll be smarter with our dodges now. We're not going to roll right into a giant casting basin thing. Again. We're also not going to get wiped by that thing. We will apparently still get pitchforked. And have skeletal dogs. And have the hounds of hell themselves fighting at our heels. You triggers are not supposed to be this fast. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Oh shit, the lift's not here. This is very bad. The lift is not here. Da -da 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 -da. Oh wait, no, it is here. That's right. Nope! Goodbye! So we can't go down this time. We can't go up, though. Um, and we can take care of the big guy up here, at least. Oh, item. Soul of a Nameless Soldier. That soul is larger looking than normal. Okay. Um, friendship. Um, hello? Hello. Who are you? Um, make peace. I help any time. Young White Bridge. Um, I guess the giant here is our friend now. Not very bright, but it's our friend. Yay! I'm not sure how much benefit we have in having a giant as our friend. Oh, he gave us a Young White Bridge. What does that do? Um, transform, blending into the environment. Okay, that's... We got one of those before. 
So I guess that's the archer taken care of. Um, I don't think so. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, so the arrows are taken care of at least, but we still have this guy down here to consider. So let's kill an icy, um, whatever dude mini form then. Yeah. Excuse me. All right, so we got this dude down here. It is fast, but I'm pretty sure we face a tough threat in the boss fight, to be honest. Um, and maybe with some proper angling. A little higher. Oh, right. we have aggro! Good lord, dude, you are friggin' fast attacker. Shit, we're frostbitten. I have no idea what that does to me. Um, please don't be dumb to use. It's be too dumb to use stairs. I think it's too dumb to use stairs, really. Okay, good. It's too dumb to use stairs. That's a relief. Or it can still nail me. Screw you, dude! The Ithril Straight Sword. What is that? Um... Ithril straight sword, Sander, thrust. Straight sword bestowed upon the Outrider Knights of the Boreal Valley. This weapon is enshrouded in frost and causes frostbite. Every Outrider Knight one day devolves into a beast constantly hounded by Pontiff Sullivan's black eyes. Well, that explains what that was and what the boss was, in fact. And then we get an ember. Good, you stole one of my embers, you fucker. You killed me! And then the doors open, leading to an unknown location. Okay, that is not a living tree. I was just checking. Um, I have no idea where I am right now. Absolutely no clue. We have things that can turn into bird demons, though, apparently. So that is something. Um, but yeah, I don't know where I am. Well, that's not something bad, of course. I mean, not knowing you are where you are is a key thing to being able to find all you can in a Dark Souls game. That wet a Sherving Stone, what is that? Um... Does not look to be here, so... Undo weapon infusion. But that, um... One sword we got... Seems to be... Probably an ice damaging sword. So... With it we could... Deal ice damage. Yeah, I'm not trying a plus attack here. I'm just gonna straight up magic. It. Or not. Oh, it can apparently get up just... And attack in a flurry of blows. Good lordy Lou, you fucker. Um. Got more of these things. And I doubt that they'll be as easy to kill. Soul of an unknown traveler. That one is a shaman, clearly. Um. I really have no clue where I am. Okay, you can't be hit down. Um, okay. These are Ashen here, and I think I will Ember. We were gonna do it soon enough anyways, but this way I've got access to my health being fully restored. Can I... There we go. Which 
shit. Get close enough. Get close enough. There we go. There we go. And you spewed a purple miasma. We just got an Estus. That's awesome. So that one is a poison one. Kill. There we go. You don't have a lot of bleed resistance. Ow! That was my ears, you fucker. Frick, you don't have to screech like an unholy abomination that you are to kill my eardrums. Yikes, that hurt. I mean, I get the games are supposed to be difficult, but actually hurting you IRL by blaring into your headphones? That's a new low, souls. A new low indeed. Assassin ahead. Where? Oh, hello. You must be the assassin they spoke of. Well, it's too bad for you that I am a magic dealer and you pesky assassins mean nothing to me. Well, I guess we gotta go down here. Tough enemy ahead. Lies. Brigand axe. Oh. Oh, hello. Ow. Man ear Mildred. Yep, it's Manny or Mildred. She's using a friggin' cleaver here. And she's throwing... Okay. I see how it is, Maneater. You wanna eat me? No. Okay, Maneater Mildred here. Is not gonna be easy to kill with magic, but maybe with something else should be a lot easier. Yeah, doing that was your undoing, man eater Mildred. Now fall. The butcher knife is ours. As expected, to be completely honest. Butcher's knife. Um high strength, axe, slash. Butcher's knife with an oddly large blade wielded by a mad woman haunting the road of sacrifices. Squarely lands hits restores H square landed hits restore HP. Back in the undead settlement, the woman acquired a taste for human flesh of which she took glee in partaking. Sharpen. Sharpening the blade increases HP restored with each successive hit. That's actually not bad. <clears throat> it's a good weapon if you are like without Estus flasks even. Yeah. It's not a bad weapon at all. And now I'm getting some lag. Um, brigand armor. Followed by... No trap, please. Brigand twin daggers. The brigand was a starting class, wasn't it? So, if you don't choose to be a brigand, this is where you end up. Dead. Kind of grim. Um, what do we have, though? We got up here. But... We're in the, are we in the Road of Sacrifices or something? Because that's what the item description implied, that Manny or Mildred was hiding in the Road of Sacrifices. But, I mean, we didn't get any, like, shifts or anything. I hope we didn't enter a new area, because we still have the boss of that last area to kill. Try ranged battle. On what? Oh, it's talking here. Or no, from here. Okay. Just heavy. Heavy once. And then kill. Drink an Ashen to restore our FP. Bonfire ahead. Try jumping. You know, that actually seems mildly believable. Did you just friggin' Oh, crap. 
We do not have a lot of health. And we got a lot of souls and I have no clue where I am. You know what? We can come back here later. This is probably a new area. So... Um, Shrine Bonfire. Woo! Okay. Um... That was... Interesting, an interesting new area for sure. Rest at the bonfire again. Now, people, now we will actually continue onwards. Um, the diapolated bridge. With the giant dude now on our side, we should be good to go, I hope. <coughs> Excuse me. Alright, undead settlement. We are embered, which is very good, very good indeed. And now we will find out if. The giant bro will in fact help us up there. He's watching out for us truly, or if it was all just a lie. I doubt it was a lie though. He was very honorable. Alright, we can five hit with our current endurance and the Gigantana able to knock out one of these guys if we can get it through. That's always good to see. And then we got this way. Okay. So far, so good. Um, look for any hidden items? No. Okay. I don't hear anything coming towards me. Eating soul. Okay, giant bro. Now is your time. Giant bro is in fact helping me out here. Um, he must have double tap or something though because... Okay, he is where? Yeah, he's like trying to double tap here. You know, I appreciate it, Giant bro, I really do, but you don't need to. Another young white branch. Large certain corpses, two parts of the workers' equipment. We will be going for that, if only because it's probably, it might be worth it, you know, risk, reward, translation, workers' trousers. Are we really going to get the workers set here? Back off. Back off. Giant bro, kill. Thank you, giant bro. Okay. Still going for the double tap, I see. I admire you, giant bro. I admire you. Okay, um, I very much doubt I can get over there, but this is probable. Just so long as we don't... Overjump! Or underjump. Good. Undead Bone Shard. What is that? Burning Bonfire to increase Estus recovery. Alright, that's awesome. We now have a reason to go back to Firelink. But I'm not going to, not until we find another bonfire. Um, wait, is that something or just a message? The arrows of a giant rain down beside the white birch. Well, yeah, I've kind of figured that out. Thanks for, um, informing me, though. Oh, shit, it's red eyes. Giant bro! Giant bro! Giant bro? Anytime now. There we go. Good on you, giant bro. I got him. Don't. Okay, Giant Bro, I appreciate your enthusiasm here, dude. But, um, you can cool it a little bit. Giant Bro seems to be a little over eager to help. He must like the White Birch. I wonder if he wouldn't have been friendly with me if I didn't give him a White Birch. That's a distinct possibility, now that I'm thinking on it. Okay here. A great scythe. Frosted flakes. They're more than good. 
they're great. That's what I think of when I hear the word great. Sometimes, not always, very rarely, in all honesty. I'm a fraud! Okay, um, that just circles around. There's gotta be something a little deeper in here. There is. Something, something. Oh, God. Oh, you sneaky little bugger. Um, the cleric set. So, this is where the cleric makes it to. Before dying. Mortician's Ashes. Another new item. Um, keep looking around here, I suppose. Yeah, the cleric dies there. And, is that everything? That does appear to be everything. Okay, let's check what these Mortician's Ashes are all about. Um, rubbish. Where is it? Is it a key item or something? It is. Shrine Handmaid will prepare new items. Umbral Ash of a resident of the Undead Settlement who made a living burying corpses. With this, the Shrine, the shrine Handmaid will prepare new items. Well, that's another motivation to go back to Firelink. Not that I'm going to do it right now, because, again, I'm waiting until we find our next bonfire. Or until we run out of flasks and run very, very low on health. Nah. Okay, what do we got over here? Branches, branches. Lots of these flowers. Um... Hang on a moment. First, check over here. Not a secret room. Okay. Secret room. I'm playing too much Binding of Isaac, I guess. This is it, isn't it? Yep, this is it. This is the boss fight. Well then, um... I didn't expect the boss to be so close, but... I said that we would be fighting them, so we will be fighting them. Should we take a phantom for the first one, though? That is the question. Um... Uh... <sighs> mad phantom. Uh, Mad Uncle Rot. <laughs> That's a great name. Almost makes me think it's a legitimate one. But... Mm, I don't know. Should we? I mean, we kind of got to, don't we? Yeah, we do. Okay. Um... I'm talking about fighting this, but not the fam. I'm not certain on that. Um, you know, this is fairly close to a bonfire, so... And we do have an extra ember, so we'll go without phantom assistance for the first try. Nearly full health as well, which is good. Alright, boss. Where ya be? Where ya be, matey? I'm waiting for ya. Let's kill your little followers here. Oh god, they're actual fighters. Um. You will not make me injured for this fight. If you do that, I will be severely pissed off. Come on. There we go. Red cloak style one shot. Much like red shirts from Star Trek apparently do. And... Oh god, you're a red eye. You're a fucking red eye. No, no. First rotted grave. Still got the little NPC dudes all around. Oh. Well. Oh. oh shit! Where'd you come from? Crap! Do you guys regen? Please don't tell me you guys come back to life. And it rolls. Oh. Um, magic is not 
gonna be the way here. I can already tell. Are you kidding, you fucker? No! 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 You guys should not be alive! This thing killed all of you! I saw it! We're out of Estus already. This is bad. Where are these guys coming from? I really want to know. Oh, shit! Holy crap! I'm screwed. I am so fucking screwed. Well, game. Well, well, well. I, um... Kind of figured. I kind of figured. To be completely and totally honest. Oh, from a distance it looks like we're okay, but close up, no. <sighs> this is not gonna be an easy one. Okay, first things first, we should probably head back to Firelink. Having a better Estus recovery is going to be huge. Yeah? Yeah. So, we're gonna wanna burn this um, undead bone shard. Yes. Estus flask is now plus one, as is the ashen Estus flask. And then we're gonna see if this guy over here will give us more power, because I'm needing it right now. I really am. dead. Did you kill him? Who are you? Oh, prithee. Art thou good yours, master? Good you You killed him! I am Yuria of Londor, a close friend of his. He's dead! Thanks to thee, your soul is redeemed. What do you mean? Allow me to express my gratitude in his stead. The dignified bow. Okay. Another matter. That a lord, art thou not? Um. Bearer of the Dark Sigil. And our Lord of Hollows. Hollows. For the time thou remainst our lord, we of Londor shall serve thee. And I, of course, am also thine. Okay. That Area a lord, of Lord art not? Bearer of the for the time that and that that'll bear for and no I new dialogue. You have some more stuff. Um, poison throwing knives are curse undead curse build up and cures hollowing, so that'll probably make me look better. Londor Braille Divine Torm. Learn miracles of Londor. Um, same sorceries. The dark hand. Untrue Dark Ring. Retain human appearance while hollow. Untrue White Ring. Take the appearance of a white phantom and a ring of sacrifice. Till we meet my the You're with Aeth, aren't you? You're the second coming of the Dark Wraiths. Um... I truly don't know what to say. True. Oh, we are not if do not be gone um, for long. Yeah. I really don't know what to say. Where the they, that thing can, that person, Yuria, considers us Lord Hollows. And then all those of Londor will apparently be at our side. I really don't know. Ah, oh, how? Um, give Umbral Ash. Gracious. Let the. I only hope. <laughs> what are your new wares? Oh, wow, you got a lot of them. Um, three more embers. Repair powder, moss clump, firebomb, prison, alluring human. Human pine resin applies dark. So, human is dark damage, apparently. Um, tower key, grave key. Key to a door in the undead settlement sewer. Okay, um, only door I can think of is the one that's 
got that one person locked behind it. That's a big possibility. Um, nothing else though. Ashen. Yeah. So we need 1,500 for that. Um, that will wait, of course, because we still have a boss fight to do. The cliff underside is probably the preferred area. Um, well, this will be interesting. This will definitely be interesting. Um, hello. Al ready to die. Because you are dead. Not really. Um, we're gonna have to fight our way back down there, aren't we? We are. Okay. Um, when I'm back at the boss fog gate, I will be back with you guys because I don't honestly know how long I've been going for, and I don't really want to exceed time by too much, and I imagine this fight is going to be one that takes a while, even with it. So I will see you guys soon. Okay, people, I'm back. I realize I do not have a lot of time left in this video, but I did not mean to summon you, but I guess you're coming in, and um, do we have any that look like official phantoms in here? Not really. Um... Hello, Phantom Ian. I bow to the Phantom Ian. And then, um... Sure, Phantom Dankle as well. I will summon the... This definitely seems like a two-boss, or two-phantom sort of boss fight. Especially considering my somewhat limited time on this. Um... I bow to the warrior of sunlight, Danko. All right, people, let's get this boss. Hello. Oh, that's sweet. There's the carvings in here. Um, dignified bow. Next time. Okay. Through the fog we go. Through the fog we go. I hold the chariot to the fog we go. Jolly cooperation, jolly cooperation. I hold the chariot, jolly cooperation. Oh gosh, things are stronger now. Oh no, I know they're not. Um, this big guy's up. Okay, things are stronger. More help. Okay, um... Whoa! Whoa! Stumble me, why don't ya? Freaking flash. Uh... I don't know what you did, but... Holy cannoli! What dealt so much fucking damage? Who did, like, more than a quarter of his health in one shot? Okay, that's poison. Poison. Poison is bad. Not in the poison anymore, game. Um. Warrior of Sunlight! What are you puffing your weapon with? Oh, I don't like this! Plunging attack. Just for... Hey, we're here! We're here again! And there's an arm! Okay, you know what? Magic time!
brought Ooh. a great wood, transposing kill, and a sunlight medal. Dignified bow to the both of you, warrior of sunlight, Dankle, and Phantom Ian. You two are awesome. Um, we got a transposing kill, which is that what that one dude wanted. Whoa, whoa dude, you're dead. Oh no! Die! And I just got random souls. Poor dude here, he died. Aw. Sorry. Well, um. Wait, this didn't lead to anywhere. That that path must have been the one we were supposed to go down. Okay. Um. Well, I guess that is it for the undead settlement outside of that one um gate area. But we're heading that way next time anyway, so I guess we'll do that then. For now, though. I think it's about time I end this video off. So, I've been Solrak Dragon. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. If you have, leave me some feedback in the form of a like or a comment. If you guys want to check out some more videos by me, be sure to um, check out my channel below. And if you like what you see, drop me a subscription. Outside of all of that, I will Till see you all in the next video. Have a... Oh, back. Have a fantastic oh, hello. day, everybody. Got more embers too, as well as lightning burn. Um, no materials, no key items, no spells. A lot of weapons, though. A lot of weapons. None that I'll likely use, though. Just checking him real quick. Assassin, hard leather, and knight equipment. And that's it. Okay. Goodbye. I guess. <laughs> I will officially now see you all in the next video.